guys, um, today I'm making a new video, and this is the top five worst Mario power-ups. So today, we're going to be starting off by number five is the skinny mushroom. The skinny mushroom is a little different from all the others and also weird power-up. One reason why it's weird is because that when Mario has this or eats it, whatever I say, turns into like almost the size as Waluigi. But why would Nintendo even make this? I just don't know. And how to unlock it is to complete a world championship. Yep, a world championship in the event courses. And then you kind of realize this is a little bit ugly when you wear this it's just it's just a weird version of mario wearing this i just don't like how it's being like this here is footage of mario doing this and now he turns into a super mushroom now that's better but here we come to number four and that is Skip this part. The big mushroom. The issue about this mushroom is that it turns every enemy in Mario. And when you have a dry boat, Luigi is actually riding on it. And the even shockiest part is that Peach rides Bowser? Just come on, Nintendo. That's just weird. That is just so weird, Nintendo. Alright, moving on to number three. I know, this is going to take a little forever. But... But it is going to be the in this and allows you to float in the Yep, the p the pea blue from Super Mario World. I'm not talking about the pea blue from Mario Maker 2, the pea blue from the original Mario Maker. You see the difference? Now you get it. But the issue about this power up was that it had limited of time. The power-up that we had right now for Mario Maker 2 didn't have a limited time. It was a free power-up. And I kind of don't like how you get popped when you're small Mario and then you just die. That is kind of a little issue. And now we are going to number two as, as the top worst. As the top worst in my opinion. Now... Now I'll skip a bunch of parts in this video, which definitely hurts me. And though this is not really a power up, but I just put it in there because it was a little unfair. And that was the poison mushroom. You know that poison mushroom that killed you in Super Mario Bros. 2, the Japanese version? Well, it hurts you. This was a little bit annoying. Back in 1986. Nintendo would create a Japanese game similar to Super Mario Bros. in the NES. But, whenever you small Mario and then people saw this unknown power-up that Nintendo made, and then they were shocked. They just died. And then they got so mad that they didn't want to touch that thing anymore. Well, that happens now because they included it in here. I just don't like how it is. And before we get to number one, I would like to do some dishonorable mention. One dishonorable mention. And it is in the worst power-ups video. And it should be in this video. I know this is taking forever, but I know. And this power-up is a little bit uncool. 
Well, because I have the controllers are so bad. Making you bounce everywhere. Uh, what? Uh, that's right. If you played Super Mario. The spray mushroom is a little bad because the controllers are bad. The spray mushroom is a little annoying. Well, mostly because it just spouts Mario's everywhere and turns him into a spring. This spring is only in Super Mario Galaxy. And this is really annoying because I don't like how its controls are. The controls are so bad. Like, I don't even like how the bouncing is bouncing Mario's head. Just look. Look right here in Mario's head. He just bounced his head. That's just ridiculous. And now, and now, and if we go to number one, oh, and the number one worst Mario power-up I've ever seen is going to be here. Wait for it. Do you know it? And that is the mystery mushroom. This was a huge problem. This people were claiming that this was almost like Nintendo Maker, not Mario Maker. Like it just seriously turned you into a costume of a Nintendo character. And you know what was really annoying? It turned people into car it turned Mario to cartoon characters. Hello Kitty and Shot the Sheep. What the heck, Nintendo? Is this something that you wanted? Or is this something that this is not for kids? This is so ridiculous. This is so ridiculous. <sighs> oh my god, before we, this mystery mushroom thing actually has... This one was an obvious reason why it was a worse power-up. Because nothing had power. A power-up is something like you have power. But Nintendo made something a little bad. This was no power. All it was just, just turning costumes with no power. How ridiculous Nintendo did. And also, in Super Mario Maker 2, they kind of fixed a little bit this issue. The SMB2 mushroom and the Link sword. That changed a little bit, and it was a little better. So, and this is all just my only opinion. This is just my opinion. Just like in the last video. And the mystery mushroom is a little bit, I don't know. It's just so bad. that I just don't like the power. I just don't like how Nintendo made this. Like, people kind of said, like, this was Nintendo Maker instead of Mario Maker. Here are some power-ups I want to show you that had no power. This is, is just literally showing poses of him. Just, just literally showing his And why is that showing his butt? Look, this literally has no power. Like the frog suit. And what the heck is that? I just don't like how they made this. Why couldn't you just put it in other things? In other things, like the frog suit, like you showed. Why didn't you just only put it in other ones? That's just so ridiculous, Nintendo. You even included Baby Mario? Really? With no power? Like the Super Mario Bros. 3 ones. They should have. The Mario Maker. Hold up. If you see this Mario Maker thing, that Mario Maker thing has no power. And you know what this means? Super Mario Maker 2 is actually better than Super Mario Maker. Because it fixed all the problems about these power-ups. And I kind of think that Mario Maker 2 is way better than the Mario Maker original and the 3DS version. And, but that is making 
Mario Maker a little worse. And do you know the Haber suit? The Haber suit in the Japanese Mario Maker Direct? Well, that's actually a power up now. Because you could do break hard blocks. You could make you could make boxes to get up in places. And I think that's all it is. Just doing those powers. Super Mario Maker 2 is way better than this. And I I just feel like Mario Maker is a little bit like nothing. Just there just a little bit not great. It's just that I, I kinda don't like how it's like right now it's a little bit it's kind of been sold out, which means I kinda don't like it anymore. The Mario Maker, the original one. Well, I like better the Super Mario Maker 2. It's so better than Mario Maker. And this is just so better. <gasps> and the powers of them do not even exist. It just so is posing. That's the real issue about this. Is that they don't show anything. I just don't like how this is happening. I just don't know why. And why would you do this, Nintendo? It's just not great. This is it for the video. I just... Let me calm myself down. I got a little bit angry at the mystery mushroom. It's just that the mystery mushroom has no power. That was the issue about this whatever thing. It's... And that's just it for all the video. I mean, this is it for the video. And um, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And also hit that notification bell. You see, one of my newer videos coming up. See you next time, and bye bye